الحمد لله والصلاة والسلام على رسول الله وعلى آله وصحبه ومن اتبع هدا Dear brothers and sisters, this inshallah will be the last video of the pearls of Ramadan. And it is a great, a great video, inshallah, concerning Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, the remembrance of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So this video will talk about that the remembrance of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is the relief of the believers' hearts. Remembrance, dear brothers and sisters, is the relief of the believers' hearts. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has said in the Quran, الَّذِينَ آمَنُوا وَتَطْمَئِنُّ قُلُوبُهُمْ بِذِكْرِ اللَّهِ أَلَا بِذِكْرِ اللَّهِ تَطْمَئِنُّ الْقُلُوبُ Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says, those who believe in the oneness of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, the Islamic monotheism, at-tawheed, and whose hearts find rest in the remembrance of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, verily in the remembrance of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, do hearts find rest. Malik ibn Dinar, one of the great worshippers, one of the great pious, righteous people, he said, a person's heart will never find rest except in the remembrance of Allah. Verily, in the remembrance of Allah do hearts find rest. The hearts of lovers will not be relieved except with the remembrance of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And the souls of the believers will not find rest except in seeing Him subhanahu wa ta'ala. The Noon said, this world will not be good except when remembering Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. The hereafter will not be good except through His forgiveness. Paradise will not be good except when seeing Him there. So staying alone we, for remembrance of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. True lovers of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will hate anything that distracts them from remembering Allah. They do not love anything more than staying alone in order to remember Him subhanahu wa ta'ala. When a lover's knowledge of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is complete, nothing will distract him or distract his heart and tongue from remembering Him. He lives in this world by, with his body, but his soul clings to the supreme deity. Ali ibn Abi Talib, may Allah be pleased with him, said about such people, they lived in this world. They lived in this world with their bodies, but their souls cling to the supreme deity. A poet said in this regard, my body is with me, but my soul is with you. The body is in a strange country, while the soul is in its home. SubhanAllah, that's really beautiful. Another poet said, I talk to you with my heart, but my body talks to my mates. The body sits with my mates, but my heart is preoccupied with his beloved. Dear brothers and sisters, this was the mood of the messengers and their sincere followers. As Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, يا أيها الذين آمنوا أذكروا الله ذكرا كثيرا. We pray Allah subhanahu wa taala and ask Him to grant us the the pleasure and the bounty to be among the people who remember Him all the time. And I pray, I pray Allah subhanahu wa taala to make me and my brothers and sisters who are watching this video among the residents of the paradise, the people who will see Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in the paradise. Ameen, ameen, ameen. We ask Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to accept Ramadan from us, to accept the taraweeh from us, to accept the tahajjud from us, to accept zakatul fitr from us, to accept the recitation of the Quran from us, to accept from us all our good deeds. Ameen, ameen, ameen.
والسلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته